Everybody just want to talk about time travel. Time travel is probably something that's fake for many of you. But I believe in it. And the way I believe in it is through saving time. For instance, if I want to get to from point A to point B, like let's say you want to go to New York. If you want to get there faster, you know, we have airplanes. And that's going to get you there in like four hours. If you want to go walking, it's going to take you, I don't know, like a month. So it's up to you to use what's already available to save time. Um, that for me is time travel. Do, getting things done faster. Um, looking to accumulate time rather than money. You know, use money to um, make things faster and not waste your time because your time is limited. You're spending it, whether you like it or not, it's being spent every second that you're watching this video. Use this video to kind of wake you up and be like, hey, well, time is being spent and there's things I got to do. How can I get there faster? I'm not saying like, hey, financially get there faster in terms of like all oh, wealth and stuff like that. I mean, just in general, like any chores you got to do at home, how can you do it faster? You know, because the longer you spend on something, the more likely you'll get stressed. You know, especially if it's something you don't want to do. You could have somebody else do it for you. Um, if it is business, if it's money related, then, you know, you pay for information that allows you to get there faster. And I hope you all grasp that concept of just using the tools the information the internet the vehicles that are available in this modern era to expedite whatever it is you want to get done um, be resourceful you don't really need money you can make calls you can network you can you know, ask for help to get to places faster but first you know Google stuff do the research uh, it will be worth it instead of just waiting, you know, because a lot of people just wait on stuff and waiting doesn't do anything. It just delays, delays, delays. So it's good to be in the habit of taking action and being proactive, meaning doing things ahead of time so that you're well prepared for anything that may happen in the future. So that's all I have for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it's insightful. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.